morning. Um, on behalf of Food for Free, thank you all so much for being here today. You might have seen this before. Um, <laughs> did you know that hunger in this country is less often an access to food? It's more often, or very often, an act, a lack of access to nutritious food. Imagine if you're hungry, here are your choices for $4. Low-income people have to struggle every day with every dollar, making difficult decisions. There are homeless families that are sheltered in motels that have a microwave and a bathroom sink. Imagine trying to assemble a healthy meal. And as Doc has already told you, nearly one in 10 people in our wealthy state struggles with hunger. At the same time, 40% of the food that we grow goes to waste. So much of this food is healthy produce or high quality prepared foods. Since 1981, Food for Free has been fighting hunger. Whether it's sending kids home with backpacks of food for the weekend, delivering fresh produce to homebound residents, growing organic produce for the emergency food system, or delivering healthy microwavable meals to families in motels, or providing food transportation services. We work hard to ensure that people have access to the healthy food that they need and that they deserve. At the core of our work is food rescue, that 40% of food that's going to waste. Every day, we go to supermarkets and farmers markets, wholesalers, we collect a beautiful, fresh, healthy, delicious food that would otherwise enter the waste stream, and we distribute it to over 100 partner agencies that serve low-income populations. In the last year alone, we distributed the equivalent of nearly one and a half million meals to over 30,000 people in 12 greater Boston cities. In 1981, Food for Free became the nation's first food rescue organization. Today, there are hundreds of organizations doing the same thing throughout the country. What is very exciting is we are now pioneering the next wave in food rescue, and that is prepared food. Hundreds of thousands of pounds of this food goes to waste every day. This is the food that a family living in a motel needs in order to be healthy. Today, we are picking up from seven partner organizations, including Harvard, MIT, and Google. But there is a challenge in scaling up this type of food rescue for Food for Free or any other organization. And that is that it comes when it's donated in these large, frozen, plastic bulk bags. Very practical to hand to a family or give to an individual. Thanks to a very supportive and generous donor, over the last year, we have been able to invest in figuring out how to break that food down while it's still frozen, portion it into beautiful, healthy, individual family meals. And we have been piloting distribution to uh, 400 meals a week to homeless families living in a motel in Brighton. Over the next year, we want to perfect the family meals process. We want to figure out how to scale it up at a low cost using volunteers and borrow kitchen space and ensure that we are positioned to pick up from the hundreds of organizations in Massachusetts alone that is currently throwing this food away. More importantly, we want to build a model that is replicable so that hundreds of organizations throughout the country can do exactly the same thing. We need your help, whether it's connecting us to food donors or supporting the investment in our work. Please reach out to me if you are interested in supporting this innovative new process to ensure that millions of pounds of this precious resource, food, rather than entering landfill, gets to the people who need it most. Thank you so much.